Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm really excited to show you about my at-home laser hair removal that I've been doing. I've been doing this for about two months. If you guys have been watching me on my Instagram, I've been talking about it through stories, about trying it. Um, it's really, really cool and it's actually effective. I was a little bit unsure if this was really gonna work. P.S. This is not sponsored, not an ad. They kindly sent it to me to try out, see what I think, and um, yeah. So I'm really excited about this. So I've been talking to all my girlfriends about it because I hate shaving. I'm not a good shaver because I rush and then I cut myself and I'm just clumsy. I'm not good at it. It's not my thing. Um, so I pretty much have scars all over my legs from previous cuts and stuff I suck basically. If you guys want to know how to at home laser your leg hair, which sounds so crazy that you can do this at home now. Like I remember when I was young, we didn't even... Pff, we could barely get internet, you know, like we had to get internet through the telephone line. So it's so crazy that you can laser your leg hair off at home. That's wild. But anyway, you want to see how to do it, what I've been doing, keep on watching. All right. So this goes for, I believe it's $189, but they're always having sales. I know they just had an Easter sale. Um, so if, they're, if that's still going on, I'll put it in the link below. Um, but I'll, I'll leave all the stuff in the description below. But anyway, so it's really, really cool. Um, you just basically plug it into the wall. It has a little plug right here and a really long cord. And I've been doing this. This is how quick and easy it is. I do it really quickly um, when the baby's napping in the bathroom. Like I just like boop, 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 done, boop, boop, done. The arm hair is the quickest. I think it takes less than a minute to hit both sides. Not gonna be gross. If this grosses you out, you might just wanna skip ahead, but I do my vagina and all that jazz down there. Um, that literally takes like a minute. It's very, very quick. Uh, there is really no pain to it. Basically, as the skin down there gets a little bit thinner, um, it almost feels like when you take a rubber band and you kinda like pull it and hit your skin, it's really nothing that's unbearable or like oh my god i'm comfortable or like i'm gonna cry nothing crazy about it so when you do it what you want to do is you want to try it on your arm right here just to see how your skin reacts now i didn't do that only because my skin is not sensitive at all whatsoever i could be in the sunlight for like five days straight and i won't get sunburn so basically go with your skin type everyone's skin's totally different my husband he has incredibly sensitive skin so he tried it on his arm and right here i'm going to show you when you plug it in but there's five different levels he did it on like level two one day level three one day level four one day level five one day just to see how his skin would react he had no issues at all whatsoever he's actually lasering his armpit hair right now is that weird? I'm sorry. I feel like I just told a secret. I feel like I just ratted him out. But um, again, he's got really sensitive skin. It doesn't bother him. And he cranks it all the way up to the highest level. Um, so yeah, just definitely check that out. And wait 24 hours just to see how your skin reacts. So I'm going to plug this in and I'm going to show you what I do. All right. So we're all, we're all plugged in. All right. So once it starts blinking, that means it's on, it's ready to go. So right here is where the levels are. So... If you hit if you hit this power button you'll go boop that's level one two three four five okay and that's and if you keep hitting it it'll turn it down when that red is blinking that means it's on it's working it's ready here is the like what I like about this one this is a really big area a lot of the laser at home ones are like small circles like this big I like this because I can keep track really easy of like where I put it on my leg and I feel like it gets a larger area than other ones so I'm into it. One thing about this too, so I'm hitting the button even though it's on. If it doesn't recognize that there's not any skin, it won't go off. But if it recognizes that there's skin, it'll go right off. Just like that. Really, really simple. So you basically pick your own level. I'm gonna turn it off because it's kinda loud. Now, one thing I will say, this does get pretty warm once it's warmed up. So when you put it on, make sure that the actual 
glass right here you're not pushing so hard down on your skin that the glass is like touching your skin because that won't feel good and it's not going to make a difference anyway if anything it's just going to burn you so when you do it just lightly hold it up against your skin hit the button let it do its thing you don't have to like really jam it in there and then burn your skin off because that's really will definitely burn your skin because it happened to me on my knee because i'm an idiot i'm going to show you my armpits not to be creepy so i haven't shaved my armpits in over a week and literally i don't bear i barely have any stubble so my armpit hair is pretty dark um you can see there's a little bit of stubble and i've been using this about every other day for about two months and that's pretty much me forgetting here and there like i would forget a few days i actually slacked this past week so i feel like there's more stubble so basically the darker your hair is the more you want to use it the more frequent you want to use it at first and then you'll start noticing like i've noticed on my legs which i'll show you guys that there's patches of bald spots that are just completely gone having grown in and then there's patches that are still coming through but they're coming through a little bit lighter and that is where i have really really thick hair now on the top of my thighs from my knee up to my thighs i haven't had to shave at all and i haven't even had to laser them at all they're just completely gone like except for maybe a few patches that i've missed but that is where i have my lightest finest hair so basically i haven't had to do much with that i just really have to focus main like free doing it more frequently where i have the thicker hair parts which is to be expected work with right away like how long does it take so basically the finer your hair is the quicker it's going to work secondly um the more you do it um at first so my husband he has really thin hair here he basically already lost his hair like he has like no hair coming in and he's been using it less than a month i've been using it about two months but i have really thick armpit hair i wish i could transfer it to my eyebrows that would be glorious but sadly i can't do that um so they grow incredibly fast but um i have some bald patches that just stopped growing uh this week i'm going to really focus on finishing up the two months uh I'll probably do it every day maybe two times a day i don't know i'm not a doctor i'm not a professional do you go by you know your skin and this and that but that's what how i'm going to roll because i ain't scared and i got thick ass hair so this will probably be gone i know by next month it'll be completely gone because not to be gross my down there is pretty thick too like it grows in thick darker whatever um that's pretty much gone and i've been focusing on that like constantly because i want to have no hair down there for when summer comes i'm going to show you my legs right here i get the thickest <laughs> this is so awkward i get the thickest hair like right in my ankles and like right in here and I'll show you a close-up of that, but it's all pretty much gone. I haven't shaved in over a week again. And, um, yeah, you can feel that. There's just, like, it almost feels like a few little stubbles of hair patches that just need to hit the laser for, like, another week. Or not even another week. I just need to focus on that because with, that being, with this part being small, it's hard to really make sure you get every certain significant areas are you supposed to grow your hair out are you supposed to like it as if you're waxing are you supposed to shave it like what do you do so you're supposed to make sure you are nice and clean shaven like just fresh shaved and then hit it so that you can hit the follicle you don't it doesn't matter about hitting the actual hair you want to hit the follicle and kill the follicle because that's what's going to keep your hair growing i also did right around here i did my mustache i did here and I did under here. Uh, not that I really get hair. I do get mustache hair though. I can grow a mean stash. Probably could show some guys up with my stash. So I did that. Definitely wear your hair back when you do it because I was a dummy and I had my hair down uh, and I kind of burned off a little few pieces, but it's fine. We're recovering. We're going to rebuild that. But for the most part, I'm really, really happy with it because I was looking into prices of lasering and it's like 200 and some dollars a session if not more depending where you go and you have to make an appointment and i know there's a lot of moms out there with a lot of things to do during their day and i'm a multitasker so i will sit here lasering doing five other things at one time um so it's super super convenient having it in your own house that's amazing the directions that you can even get to the point where you have to touch up maybe once a year depending on how thick or thing your hair is so that's pretty amazing and my other thing is is when you're done doing your laser deal just to make sure you hydrate your skin i've been using a really good lotion 
do a clean face. Don't do it if you're having like a breakout. Don't do it if you have like an open pimple, an open wound, anything like that. And that's pretty much it. I'm gonna show you my legs up close. So here is my ankles where they're like pretty much the hairiest, but you can see there's like pretty much all gone. Like you can see lots of bald patches, but you can see a few places that I missed just because, but this, the whole, the whole back of here is gone. All up here is completely gone. So I hope this helps you guys if you're kind of in the market thinking about it. I am going to recommend this one to you because this is the one I use. I know it works. I love you guys. I hope this helps and I'll see you soon.